Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4 Rate, and welcome to a brand new series for Ranch Simulator. This is going to be season three of this game for me. Uh, the last time I played it was well over a year ago. There has been many updates. This is a new beta branch for the game. It is on Steam for $25, but right now it's on sale for 33% off till September 28th. Let's go ahead and start a new game, and we're going to call this season three. Beautiful. Yeah, this is, uh, if you want to know how to get to the beta branch, you simply right click on the game in your Steam library, go to properties, and then go to betas and opt into the beta branch. Uh, we'll play the tutorial. It's been a while. All right, so I did play this game uh, for, I don't know, about a half hour before this video, just to kind of, you know, get reacquainted with it. Um, one thing I do not understand is why all the, why all the movement keys are all blank. Okay. Um, I know what it is, though, by the way. I'm um, WASD, of course. Look around with the right mouse. Um, sprint is, uh, control, or sorry, sprint is shift, crouch is C, jump is space bar, and hold, hold it, change camera, you don't have to hold it, it's V by the way, V is in Victor, oh, see if you hold it, it goes, it goes to first person, okay, that's good, all right, so you might think, well, Keats, just go into your options menu, and see what all the input is, <laughs> like I said, it's a beta version, so I'm not sure what the inputs are. I'm not going to mess with any of the inputs. I'm just going to guess what they are. I'm not going to try and rebind them because they're obviously working. They're just not showing up here for some reason. So I'm going to ignore all that. And we're going to go to this blue marker. I think something like my, my grandfather or something left me a farm or something. And uh, this game's really fun, by the way. This is my favorite ranch simulator game. Like ranch... Uh, yeah, I guess simulator. I don't know if you can call that a genre. But it's it's a it's a great game. It's a great game. Uh, if you read this letter, then you agreed to fulfill my last uh, will and come to our family ranch. It's desolate because I did not have the time to deal with it. Come into the office. Yep, got it. Okay. Put that back. Um, to open quest logs, press J, even though it doesn't say so. That's the quest logs. Then we're going to come over here and we're going to find the tent. And the tent's where you're going to sleep and save the game. So we're going to go right there, hold R to save the game. Beautiful. All right, and then you can sleep through the night. Uh, you don't have to eat in this game or drink or anything, so you can sleep all you want. There's no pausing the game, by the way. You jump, and the game's still running. Uh, that's how I test to see if I can, if I can, if pausing pauses the world or not. You kind of jump and then press pause, and you know press escape, and if it doesn't pause, it doesn't pause. Um, but in a game where you don't have to eat or drink, it's not really that big of a deal. All right, so we're gonna come in here, and we're supposed to get some kind of some kind of radio or something. Press L to turn on your personal light. Or, I guess, turn off the radio. I turned off the music in the game, but if, if you didn't, maybe that radio would be uh, making a bunch of noise. I don't know. So we're going to come up here. we got to find the chest. we got to remove some stuff out of the way. Um, again, it's not telling you what, no what button it is. It's tab. If you hold down tab, you can go to demolish and then just get that out of the way. Get the door out of the way. And then press tab again to get out of that. Press enter to close that. Wait, press tab again and then go to hand so you don't accidentally destroy stuff. And we're going to come on over here and see what we got in the chest. All right. We got a pistol, ammo, money, and a little note here. Take this revolver in the forest. There are many wild animals cause you trouble. I have left some money and, and uh, ammo. One more thing. You will need a car in the garage. Yeah, you got you to gotta repair the um, UTV. So now that we've done that, the, all the blue markers will be where we got to get stuff. You just get a bunch of tires and stuff. And you repair the UTV. Is it UTV? Is that right? I don't know. So I guess I think that's what it said. So that is awesome. So in this game, uh, let me give you a little bit of um, an overview of what we're going to be doing in this game. We are going to... I don't remember how to start off, but you're going to start making money. And what you can do is you can raise animals. You can slaughter animals. You have to feed and water the animals. You can... I, I don't think you could farm last time I played, but I think you could farm now. Don't forget, it's been over a year since I played. I could have swore I saw someone farming. So you might be able to, like, grow crops. Um, you can go out and kill deer. I don't remember how I was making money in the very beginning of the game. Like I said, it's been a while. So we're going to... Wait. Pick up. There we go. So you can only carry one thing at a time. It's got that realism thing to it. But you can get, you know, trucks and all kinds of vehicles and stuff. And I remember towards the end of my last Let's Play, I was... Uh, I had a bunch of... um pigs and they were reproducing and I would kill them and I would make them into sausage and then I would I would like dry the sausage and I would take it in and get a lot of money for it a lot of money for it it's um it's got that like that dopamine hit of just getting a lot of money and I don't know why I'm going in the wrong spot 
I obviously have to go to where the red is. All right, open this up. That's like a golf cart. All right, install. And pick up, all right, yep, there we go. Install the tires. So you see what we're doing here? We're fixing this bad boy up. All right, and install. Yeah, th honestly, this might be my favorite simulation game ever. Like, seriously. Um, I don't know. I think I think Gold Rush, or what was the gold one? I don't remember. I think it was called Gold Rush. Um, that might be my favorite, but this one's way up there. Way up there. And honestly, this one... Now, you know what? This one's better. But that Gold Rush game was really good as well. I don't play a ton of simulation games. They're not really... They don't really um, do well on the channel. But this one did do well, so I'm hoping that people will enjoy this game. Um, I know it's not exactly the survival genre, but it's, it's you know... Nah, it's not the survival genre. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I think people enjoy it, though. Um, I know Gold Rush uh, did pretty well, and, and this one did well last time I did it. And I did another game called uh, Another Ranch Game. What was the other ranch game? The Ranchers? That one did really well as well. So. Okay. Yeah, we just need that. And we need one more seat. This is the bumper guard. And then we just need one more seat, and I think we'll be good to go. Come on. Um, there we go. Oops. Wrong button. That's better. By the way, I can um equip the pistol like this. Let's reload it just in case we come across anything that wants to hurt us or do us harm. And then we will go back to our hand so we don't accidentally shoot ourselves in the foot. Alright, so that's the Should, am I supposed to like take this paper with me? Read. Put back. So yeah, you just put it back. I don't know why there's still a, a blue marker there. It's kind of weird. It's throwing me off because I feel like there should be a seat over there. Because I still need another seat, but there's no blue marker showing me where there's another seat. Maybe it is over there. Maybe maybe that blue marker showed me the seat. And I'm thinking it's the letter. Let's go check it out. No, that's... The, oh, yep, it was the seat. You sneaky game. You sneaky, sneaky game. I'll tell you. Oh, my goodness. All right. And there we go. Complete. What do you want me to do now? Yeah, take the jerry can. So now it's trying to tell us how to place stuff. And you can, like, you can like drop stuff or you can place stuff. If you place stuff, you can be a little bit more... You have to hold down the button. Okay. Mouse wheel. Right click. Hold it down. Mouse wheel. Scrolls it around. Um, I guess. Well, it says right there. Place. There we go. Oops. I didn't mean to flip the car. Close that. All right. We need to get to the gas station. So I'm guessing it's going to show me. Let's go ahead and enter the, enter the vehicle. And F for ignition. Lights. Handbrakes. Hitch. All right. So this thing is almost out of gas. So we gotta make sure we're going to the right spot. So where's the gas station? There we go. Okay. By the way, this is a new map from the last time we played, apparently. Hold on, let me take a look. Yeah, apparently that's a new map. Honestly, I don't remember the old map. So, uh, people were saying it's a new map, so I guess it's a new map. Like I said, I don't remember. Should I go off-road? Probably not, but I'm going to anyway. Whoa, this is a little... This is a little loose. A little loosey goosey with the uh <laughs> with the vehicle controls. Alright, well that didn't save me much time, but a little bit. Who knows? Maybe you use more gas if you go off-road. I do have some money. I don't see where it says how much money I have. I see the early access version, I see the day, the time. I don't see anything about money. Hey, the cars are moving. There's actually people driving around. That's new, man. That's new for me anyway. Okay. Let's see if we can figure this out without reading. Uh, how do we... F for ignition. E to get out. Let's grab this thing. And then we put it right there. There we go. And we start refueling. There we go. It's taking all our money. What does it say our money? Gotta be a place for it to say our money. Jay? Steam ID. Oh, household balance. Okay. It's not going down. Hmm. All right, whatever. All right, jerry cans filled up. So now we grab this thing. Left mouse button. 
put it back. I mean, I guess you don't have to put it back, but I'm, we're not animals. Here, let's see if I can get hurt. Oh, I guess not. <laughs> I guess that's a good thing. All right, car filled. All right. Oh, we're supposed to fill the car, not the jerry can. Oh, I guess I can fill both. Oh, no, it wanted me to fill both. Never mind. All right, so we put that right there. And we had 460. Quest complete. Okay, there it's going down. Okay. Talk with the real estate agent. Okay. I don't know why. I already have the place. Um, where is the real... Oh, it's far away. Let's take a look at the map. Oh, so it doesn't show them on the map. That's, that's a little annoying. It should probably show them on the map as well. But let me just save. Can I save it? Any oh, no, I can't save unless I'm in my... Unless I'm at my, um... My tent, that's right. Okay, so ignition is F. Still getting used to that. And I guess I'll go this way. I can't see it on the map, so I can't plan out what the quickest route would be. But I just, I guess, we're, now this looks like the quickest route. Coming through. Get out of the way, everybody. Where's the, where's the horn? All right. Oh, boy, we should probably slow down. Okay. <laughs> I thought I'd be okay going as fast as I want, but I, I guess not. Probably shoot that deer. I'm going to leave him alone, though, for now. Here we are. Ignition. Let's get out. Come in here. See what's what. All right. Well, is this so dark? And oh, wait, is this is this the right spot? Even this looks like a car dealership. Am I at the right spot? Oh, I see. Why is it so dark, man? Get some lights, bro. Sup? Good day. Any chance uh, you need the owner of the nearby ranch? Yes, it's me. In that case, I must give you the construction manual. This book will help you rebuild your ranch. Keep in mind the construction is only permitted on your ranch territory. Got it. Um, that's all I want to tell you. Good luck. Thank you. All right. Using the radio menu, you can now enter build mode and build on your ranch. The following building materials are required for construction. Wooden planks, bags of cement, metal rebar. Wooden planks can be made by yourself, and the rest of the building materials can be bought at the hardware store. All right. So... Uh, let's talk to the car salesman. Yeah, because we're going to want a proper car at some point. Like, you know, although I only see one car in here. They had more options last time, at least. Maybe I'll have options. Welcome. Here you can buy a car or customize it. For all our new customers, we install radio for the four-wheelers for only $10. Just drive garage. Drive into the garage if you want your radio. Uh, if you want to buy a vehicle, use the computer in front of me. Um, okay. What's the difference between cars? Okay. Fair enough. Goodbye. Let's take a look at the computer. Not that we're going to buy a car right now. All right, so they do have more choice. Okay, so this is the UTV. I already have it. It shows you what it can hold. It can hold two pigs or two goats. Okay? Because when you buy animals, you have to buy them and then bring them back to your back to your place. And this is the pickup. All right. It can hold um, goats or more pigs and a cow, I guess. Then there. Oh, look at that thing. That doesn't hold anything. Uh, all right. Oh, yeah, there we go. Four pigs, four cows, or four goats. The sedan doesn't hold anything. SUV doesn't hold anything. A tractor? Oh, I wonder if... The oh, harvester. All right, a lot of that stuff is new to me. Uh, oh, you really want me to install the radio? Seriously? Ugh, why do I get a... I don't want a stupid radio. All right, well, they're telling me to install the radio. I guess they want me to show me how to do the, you know... Because you could, like, mod out the vehicles and paint them and stuff, so... I guess it wants me to learn how to do that. Uh, okay. Extras. None. Radio. Upgrade. Alright, you happy? Hardware store reach. Alright, it must be good to the hardware store. Uh, where is that? That's not that far. That's not that far. It seems like this uh, map is a lot smaller than the other map. Which, you know, isn't really necessarily a good thing. I hope they make it a little bit bigger. Feels like I can get everywhere really quickly. Which, I mean, I don't know. Is, like, driving around really that important? I don't know. But I guess being able to get stuff, get places quicker is better. I'll just park right here, because that's where I want to park. I park where I want! Okay. Yeah, I, okay, I remember these terminals now. Uh, buy items. Axe, crowbar, and cheap table saw. Axe, 
crowbar and cheap table saw. Cheap table saw. Axe. I wonder what the crowbar is for. I know what the axe is for. Hey, okay, cart. Check out. Wait, how's my balance 674? I thought it was lower than that. Was it like 400 and something? That's weird. I thought it was like four something. Did I make money somehow and didn't notice? Thank you for your purchase. Yeah, that's really weird. I didn't do anything to make money. Are you? Am I getting money from doing the quests? Hold on, let me take a look. Jay. I feel like quests are giving me money. That's the only thing that makes sense to me. Okay, so what we're going to do now is... I think I could pick these two up and just carry the table saw. Normally, normally what you would do is... Pick it up. Pick it up, man. I'm pressing left mouse button to pick it up. He's not doing it, though. That's weird. Right, let me try and pick up the crowbar. Nope. I can pick this up. That's weird. Why can't I pick those up? Oh, I had to press E to pick it up. Okay. Press left mouse button to pick up. Okay. Well, there you go, guys. If you have a problem with that, left mouse button is not the is not what you're supposed to use. Now, normally you would you wouldn't be able to like carry all the stuff you bought. You buy like a bunch of stuff. You can't you can't just carry it. You can only carry it one at a time. So what you would do is you would pull your vehicle around back into the loading area, which would make it easier for you. But I don't need to do that because most of the things I could just. There we go. What's next? Talk to the seller. Wait, what? Okay. It's kind of a strange name for something. A seller? Seller of what? Oh, I see. It's a general store. Okay. So seller of what? Uh, a lot of different things. Yeah, just general stuff, I guess. What's up? Uh, welcome. To use terminal. Purchase. Be outside for more from Yeah, I got it. You're useless. I don't even know why you're here. All right. Oh, what was I supposed to buy? Egg basket and two chickens. All right, so two regular chickens, not a rooster? Okay. And a egg basket. So I think if you get eggs, you have to have an egg basket or something. Yeah, it's, it's starting to come back to me now. Check out. All right. Chicken pickup outside, egg basket. All right, so the egg basket. Just kind of put in here. I think I got to put the chickens in the back as well. I don't remember how to move them. I think it's something about a leash. I don't know. Let's see. Maybe I just pick them up. I mean, they are chickens, so. Yeah, you just grab them by the neck. That's all. You know, you're good to go. Um, Flip car, enter car. So I should be able to just put them right here. All right, you stay there. I'm sure he'll listen to me. All right, we'll grab this next one. Hey, grab you by the neck. All right, so you can see his health. Is water and, and food bar. You do have to obviously take care of your animals. Um, it's kind of weird. They asked me to buy these things where I don't have any water or anything for them yet. But, you know, I will trust that the game knows what it's doing. Let's get back to our ranch. So they want me to put the chickens, and I quote, somewhere on the ranch. Okay. So I guess right there is fine. I'm guessing they're not going to run away. Can they get eaten? I don't know. All right. Grains found, poor food. All right, so I must have had some food here already. All right, we're going to have to go inside for that. All right, so that's why they didn't ask me to get food or drink or anything. I probably have water right there as well. All right, here we go. And then we pour it on the ground around the chickens. Uh, release. Place. No. Release. Hmm. How do I do that? Or on the ground. It doesn't say. Um, I'm pressing F and E. I don't know how to do this. What about this? Pick up. You have to place it on the ground first. Like, you know, hold down the right click and left click. And then you can pour it on the ground, apparently. So there we go. Bucket found. All right. Yep, yep, yep. Got the bucket. Got this thing. Oh, uh, press to pick up. Release plus water tank found. I guess I got to pick it up maybe. Yep. Water tank installed anywhere on the ranch. Okay. So we'll put the water tank right here. And then buckets of water poured. Okay. 
grab the bucket and pick up okay so i don't see that's just a pickup I, I don't see how to get the water out of there oh i see there's a little green thing you put the bucket right on the green thing to install it um although you gotta press e not left mouse button there we go oh yep see i am getting money rewards cool small coop blueprint went ahead and slept through the night and i did figure out how to build stuff it's hold tab and then go to build menu uh, so that's um, all kinds of pla foundations, platforms, walls, windows, stairs, more windows, barn door, um, farmhouse. These are pre-built farmhouses for you. Uh, these are barns. I remember. Yeah, this stuff's all coming back to me there. By the way, there's the chicken coops, fences, wells, cactus, wall signs, uh, wall decorations, all kinds of stuff. Yeah, it's pretty nuts. Okay. Um, what did it say? The small chicken coop? All right. Small coop. Sounds good to me. Why is it? Wait, I went, I slept. It didn't, it didn't sleep through the night. Press E to sleep. Um, I'm sleeping. Now what? There we go. Now it's morning. Okay. That was weird. Like I slept and it only slept for like a couple hours. I'm not really sure. I don't know. Probably did something wrong there. I'm not going to worry about it. All right. Small chicken coop. And we'll put that. I don't know. Seems like a pretty good spot. Again. Nah, let's put it over here. Which side? Where's the openings? I can't really tell if I'm going to be perfectly honest. Which means I probably shouldn't put it against anything if I don't know where the openings are. Alright, I'm going to assume that the openings are on this side. And then we're going to line it up. Pull it away. That's good right there. Alright. Alright. Take your jerry can, take this table saw. We got to cut down some tree. Okay. I see what it wants me to do. All right. So we're going to take the table saw. We are going to unpack it. Although, you know what? I think I'm going to take this with me here. Why don't we do this? Why don't we get everything out of here first? Come on, open. Pick up. Put that right there. Pick this up. Put this right here. And then we're going to take the table saw with us. And I think I want to do this because I remember back in the day, I would like take the table saw out to where I'm going to like be doing all my sawing. Right. And then you would just have all the, and you just put all the um planks in the back of the vehicle. I get through here. Yes. So you come out here where there's a lot. <laughs> come out here. That was my voice. I um, come out here like where there's a lot of trees. You set this up. Oh, I'm going to need the jerry can to run that. That's why I wanted me to take the jerry can. Oh, we got some logs over here. All right. I didn't see those logs. I'm going to cut down the trees anyway. Because I want to. And uh, we'll use those logs, but I'm also going to cut down some trees for you guys. Let's just show you how it's done. So right here, you just put that right there. Whoops. Wrong button. E, there we go. Oh, I don't want that on right now. How do I turn it off? Pick up, turn off. There we go. I don't know why it's automatically on. All right, anyway, you cut down some trees and you get these logs. I don't know how many you can pick up. I think can you pick up two? No, you can only pick up one. And then once you get the log, you simply insert it right there. And I guess it's got to be on for that. Makes sense. All right, and then you just keep doing that. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna do that with all three of these logs. And I'm also going to cut down a tree for you guys. Just about done. And come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Whoops. Why wouldn't that? Hold on. There we go. And then we press tab. We go. Oh, that's. Oh, I don't remember how to. Crap. I don't remember how to chop down trees. I see the cut tree. There you go. Piece of cake. All right, and then chop tree again. And then you grab these and you put them in here. So once you get the um, planks, can I pick up one plank? Yeah, you can pick up a few planks. And then what you would do is you'd put them in here. Right? Yep, there you go. And then that way you don't have to like run back and forth as much. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to continue uh, processing this tree. Then we'll go back and build that chicken coop. Yes, it is all coming back to me now. Oh, I really, I miss this game. This game's really good. Really good. 
If you're not sure, think, eh, I don't know, this doesn't really look like my type of thing. Watch a few episodes. I'm telling you, you're gonna you're gonna love this game. All right, here we go and insert and oops and insert. Really, one freaking plank short. Are you freaking kidding me? I thought I had plenty. All right, well, let's go get another freaking tree. Man, that sucks, dude. <laughs> what I'll do is I'll um I'll leave the logs on the ground for now, and when I uh in between videos I'll I'll bring them over. There we go. Just want to make this chicken coop start getting some eggs. I think my um main form of of uh money back in the day used to be uh, uh hunting deer. Now I don't know if that's going to be the same way now, but eggs should be a pretty good way to you know take care of business. Although they won't reproduce because I don't have a rooster, so I might want to get a rooster at some point. I remember back in the day, like, if you went into the um, chicken coop and touched one of their fertilized eggs, uh, they would, like, attack you and stuff. It was hilarious. I don't know if that's still a thing or not. And there we go. All done. Attic demolished. Second floor demolished. First floor demolished. This house is beyond repair. Let's demolish it. Okay. Let's do some demolishing. I remember this. They want me to tear down the entire house. All right. Why can't you sprint? You not sprint unless your hands are out. Okay. All right. And um, they're asking me to demolish it in a very specific way because they want me to demolish it from the top down. Because if I demolish it from the bottom up, maybe I won't be able to reach stuff. I don't know. I don't know if there's. Maybe it won't let you demolish stuff if it if it um if it like maybe it won't let you demolish stuff if it's like structurally needed. I don't know. But let's just go ahead and start taking care of business. I wish you got stuff for this. Oh, maybe I am. Maybe there's stuff falling on the ground. I don't know. I don't think so. There we go. Demolish, demolish, demolish. Yeah, demolish the highest stuff first. I don't see anything up there, so <laughs> I'm assuming I'm demolishing the right things. That's pretty. Guys. Kind of a bad. She walks in here with a crowbar and just starts freaking whacking stuff. <laughs> starts swinging that crowbar. All right, so there's going to be stuff on the floor as well. Oh, that is the floor. Never mind. Come on. Why can't I do this thing? There we go. Okay. So I think you get the idea. Let me uh, go ahead and demolish this entire house. Just finished taking out the house. Um, congratulations, you've completed the introductory quest and now know the basics. You are free to explore the open world, bid, build additional facilities, purchase and breed animals, obtain new vehicles, go hunting and expand your ranch. See the glossary for more details. It's time to build your homestead into a prosperous ranch. Good luck. Awesome. Yeah, I mean, that's a nice little tutorial, man. It really, it really tells you pretty much everything you need to know, at least in the beginning. And um, I think I am off to a good start here. How much money do we have now? Yes, yeah, so we got about 1,200. Now I need to go do some research and try and figure out exactly what I need to do next because depending on where you spend your first money is going to be a big deal on you know how you're supposed to make money. And obviously, any tips in the in you know the, the comment section uh, would be wonderful. And um, but here's the thing: I'm probably going to. So you get the you get the egg in your hand. You got to put it in there. There we go. All right, cool. Anyway, um, I'm going to be making a bunch of videos at once, so I might not see tips early enough. So if I don't, I apologize. But I'm going to put these guys in here. Hold on. Let's see how we do this. All right. Oh, no, nice. fun. It's fun. So I think if you walk over the eggs, you will break them. So I do like the way the eggs are now. They didn't used to be this cool. Um, this is a really nice way to, to handle the eggs. Um, it can hold 40 eggs. So I got to find the other chicken though and get them in there. Um, oh, I'm also going to have to get the water. Oh, how do I um give them water and stuff in there? I don't know. I'm going to figure that out, but I'm probably going to figure that next episode. There you go. Okay. I mean, I guess I could let them out to eat and stuff. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Either way, though, they're looking pretty good. I guess I could, what I could do is I could build a fence around it. Like, um, 
Yeah. What is it? How much did I take? Four wood planks. I could probably make some kind of very, you know, rudimentary, easy fence around this thing. And then that way they can get out, have their drink and water and go in there if they want to. Um, that should be pretty cool. But like I said, that's going to be next episode. If you guys want to see more of this uh, series, make sure you uncage the like button, share the videos, let me know in the comments. Um, you know, I really appreciate it. Also, if you're new here, maybe uh, subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Don't worry. We're going to be shooting a lot of those deers next episode.